Knight of Swords. Queen of Wands. <laughs> what is this? Four of Cups. For this Queen of Wands, we have a pair here. So this, there's a Divine Masculine and Divine Feminine here. It's a love reading. Hmm. Some words could have been exchanged between you and this person. If you don't know who this person is yet, if you have no idea who this person is, we'll see how this is going to go. We'll pull some more cards. Four of Cups. It's like if you resonate as a feminine energy, whether you are a fire sign or an Aquarius, you're tired of like crying over spilled milk. You've accepted what is. Like I feel like that's where you are in your life. Like you turned your back to work, to being focused on what didn't work out versus what is working out. I feel like now you are in this more forceful, powerful energy. I feel like you're standing more in your power here. <clears throat> I feel like in the past, you definitely were like thinking you missed an opportunity with somebody. Maybe even this King of Wands doesn't have to be yet, but we'll see. Mm. But there is a strong, strong like pull between you and this person. A lot of similarities. Um, if you resonate as this divine feminine, you may know you're, you are quite focused on this person. This king of wands is, let's see, let's get more. The nine of cups. Yeah, I, this, this king of wands. F five of wands in reverse with the knight of cups. This is somebody here who's not going to play games, maybe. Or if this is somebody from the past. <sighs> Let's get more. They don't want to play games anymore. They want to call a truce. Let me see. Knight of pentacles. Let's get more information here. So this is somebody here who wants to work on maybe communication. The sun card. Leo energy. There goes that devil. The two of pentacles and the devil. The devil wanted to come out so bad. So, so bad. Somebody. This is not for everybody, but someone here could have found out that a child wasn't theirs. They could be a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, a King of Pentacles here, Nine of Swords, um, underneath this King of Pentacles with the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah. And the Nine of Wands, and in this deck is two people. So it's like somebody here is tired of fighting with somebody here. Somebody's tired of fighting with somebody involving a family situation. And I feel like this fight is over or was over somebody finding out like maybe a child was not theirs. Somebody could have had a love child with this Knight of Cups and this being here and this... Somebody may not want to fight over money. Hold on, you guys. What is going on? Let's clarify, please. Clarify this King of Wands, please. Thank you. There, there goes that Nine of Cups again. One more card for this King of Wands. Four of Swords. This person is wishing and praying. What is this person wishing and praying for? Because the four of swords is here and the star is here. So this person is definitely wishing and praying for something. Especially with this nine of cups being here. <clears throat> King of... Oh, wait a minute. This is, a, this is too many cards, spirit. Six of wands, the four of pentacles, and the king of cups. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. Dang, something was publicly outed or somebody's business could have been put out into the street. Something was made public and it embarrassed somebody or the, and, and this person, this masculine has lost love for whoever this person was dealing with. 
Because whatever was whatever was put out into the streets, yeah, the death card on the bottom of the deck. And the reason why Scorpio energy, but I'm looking at, hold on, looking at the six of wands, this four of pentacles, and this king of cups, right? But all I could really see on in this deck, this four of pentacles has like a de the death, um, right? The, um, I forget his, what we call this person. <laughs> Death, basically, he's coming to claim somebody's soul, maybe even somebody's finances. But anywho, maybe this situation, this person is about to be affected by finances because whatever information they found out, it brought something to a screeching halt. Like, it left this person very emotional. And now this person is like, has lost love for somebody. You see how the Six of Wands is like, this person looks real healthy. They're celebrating. They're having a bunch of fun. But now somebody is in this Four of Pentacles energy. <clears throat> affected by something that comes to their finances and something has come to a screeching hole and now this king of cups is pouring out pouring out like this this water which represents emotion so somebody is losing finances and emotion and love for somebody here after something was exposed this this situation is definitely causing an ending somewhere or it will and this Queen of Wands knows about it. Hmm. Hmm. Somebody here could have a twin or be a twin. If this isn't the case, then somebody could have like children that are of the same age or around the same age. So like two boys or two girls kind of situation. But I feel like one of these children somebody is like not the father yeah not a sword i mean um eight of swords and somebody's like wants to free themselves from this situation um show me this devil energy oh my goodness um this situation could be involving somebody who's married with the hair of point being here with, out here by the devil show me more about this devil energy Ooh, I'm telling you, it's over. Ten of Swords. It's over, you guys. Whatever this situation is, it's over. Somebody was really, really stabbed in the back. Somebody here could have been told some news or like received some news from somewhere like a DNA test or from a hospital or from, from somewhere or received some form of test results. This is kind of giving me like somebody got sick and they had to be tested and then the tests was the test results depended on this child's health and like if this, whatever was depended on this child's health this person had to go get a, a dna test done or some form of testing yeah bottom of the deck is this hangman and you see how this person is like giving this person water while they're hanging from this tree in this uncomfortable uncomfortable position this person is like being cared for given water while they're stuck in this real weird position position so it's like somebody was waiting to receive some news to maybe help improve somebody's health here or get more information about what can cure it's like if we have this amount of information about this issue or this problem this might be very very specific i'm sorry y'all i can't i have to but like somebody could be sick here and i feel like whoever was sick it's like some information needed Whatever information that came out about these results that was needed to help a situation, whether it be a child or another adult, I feel like it's a child, but like the news was like, oh my gosh, like this is not even my child or like, cause like something is either different about the DNA. It's like someone may have wanted to help their child. Show me more. Yeah, the moon. I'm telling you, whatever this was, the ten of swords and the moon, whatever came out was somebody found out some real shit. They were they did not expect for this information to come out with the three of cups that can't make this shit up. This person could be a cancer, a Taurus, a Capricorn, an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius, or an Aquarius, or a Leo. Take it how it resonates. I don't know. This is real, real specific. I, there goes that king of pinnacles again. 
somebody even is like paying child support. I don't know. What does this have to do? What does this have to do with the collective? I mean, this could be your situation. You could be, or this could be your person situation. Somebody you haven't talked to. I don't. I don't know where you are in the mix. I don't see you. Maybe you're this. You could resonate as this queen of wands, or you could resonate as this masculine out here. Fine. I feel like the masculine is. I don't know. I don't know who you resonate as, but what I'm telling you is there's a masculine here. I feel like either finding out somebody is not their child, someone is not their child, or there's a love child from somewhere else. I, they could have, this masculine could have had one somewhere else, or this feminine could have done this. Clarify this queen of wands. Let me see. Queen of pentacles. So we done already saw, this is about a couple. Clarify this queen of wands. The empress, yeah, this is about a couple. Clarify this empress and this queen of wands. There goes that damn king of pentacles. Clarify this queen of wands. The tower, the tower. With the seven of pentacles. So I feel like this queen of wands or this empress, however you want to, I don't, somebody was putting money into, somebody spending money trying to figure something out. I don't, it, or somebody saved some, show me more here. It's like somebody was waiting to hear this news. They finally found out like this was a big ass blow up or shocking turn of events. Somebody thought they were hiding something for a long time and then boom, the truth is out now the tower energy. What is that? Yeah, this nine of wands wants to come out again. It was a fight between two people. <sighs> Give me more information on this queen of wands. This empress. Thank you. Two of cups. This is a this is a connection, but it came out crossing. Definitely some issues. Show me this King of Pentacles. The Chariot card just came out. Could definitely be a Cancer, but it came out crossing. This King of Pentacles is like put something to a screeching halt. Show me this King of Pentacles. The lovers, yeah, they put something, could be a Gemini. They put this situation, show me this King of Pentacles. Something has come to a screeching ass halt. Yeah, Page of Pentacles in reverse. Ace of Cups, Six of Cups. Somebody, this King of Pentacles has a decision now. A decision. Two of Swords. It's a difficult decision. Yeah, the decision is whether or not they're going to walk away and leave this feminine. Because look at this Eight of Cups. This masculine is walking away and leaving this feminine left dry. Remember that King of Cups poured out that water? Well, guess what? The masculine does not have any more feelings left for this feminine. And this feminine is looking in this damn cup that this King of Pentacles poured out earlier. And they're about to walk away and be single. Look, remember this? Remember this card? Hello. <laughs> I can't make it up. And then after that was the Eight of Cups walking away from this emotionally dissatisfying situation. And now they're free, freeing themselves. Nine of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles in reverse. They ain't giving somebody something else no more. The Chariot Crossing, they're making a decision to put something to a screeching hall. It was a hard decision here. This person was in denial, maybe. I don't know. This could have been somebody, like I said, Six of Cups, Ace of Cups. I feel like they're running off to go somewhere else. Or just to love themselves. It could be. <sighs> I don't know. These two children are going to always love this, this, this masculine, though. Somebody could be sending these children to their grandparents' house, maybe. All right, so 
What does this have to do with the collective? I don't know. Maybe this is you and this person, but. Three of Swords. What does it have to do with the collective? So I feel like Page of Wands. Okay, good. I feel like if collective, if this isn't you, you're like, oh yeah, I know who that is. Or maybe you don't. You had an inkling. You have an inkling that this could be your person's energy that you haven't talked to. I don't know. Apply it where it fits. The reason you're hearing about this Three of Swords and the Hangman is because like... Um, you could be a Libra or a Pisces if I didn't say that. It's like there's been a pause. Like I know whatever you had going on with this person, you've been healing. And it's you kind of been in limbo taking care of yourself. Um and you haven't talked to this person or heard from this person. You're about to hear from them. Um, Page of Wands. They're about to tell you about this energy here. Five of Wands. Yeah. I mean, five of swords. I'm sorry, five of swords. I'm tripping y'all. This person may be coming towards you because they want to talk about what happened. And they're about to come crying to you and maybe need your nurturing love and support. I don't know. Like, this person expects for you to take care for them care for their broken heart or they're going to come towards you talking about this is the energy that they're in and this is what happened to them um hold on that's what i feel show me what else why does the collective need to know about this yeah toxic lifestyle and goodbye you see somebody's leaving a toxic lifestyle it behind them they want to they're gonna have to what what is why does the collective need to know about this love i can't make this shit up oh my god love child either somebody's not the father or the you know what i'm saying or uh they had a baby somewhere else that's it <laughs> backstab on the bottom of the mother Dick. Tell this, this this is what I that's just what I've been saying. Pain, cheating, deception, buying games, love bombing. <sighs> Alright, listen. So this person about to come towards you and tell you all of this. Get prepared, or maybe this was you that went through that situation. Just, you know, take it as it resonates. And I know y'all hear that all the time. I, I feel like this isn't even your reading. I feel like this is not your reading. And for whoever this resonates for, yeah, love, hate, relationship, and left you hanging. That's why spirit wants you to hear about this. Because literally, the three of swords and the, um, the, um, hangman is damn here. They broke your heart and left you hanging. For those of you who want to know why somebody ghosted you and why you ain't heard from them, it's because and why you ain't getting no closure or they haven't responded to your text messages or they ain't called you because they left you on red. They left you hanging. Child. And they played games with you. They were trying to get a hold of the situation. They didn't want to tell you. They didn't want you having them in their business because... They got a lot of drama going on that they are embarrassed about. Whether they're the one who had the love child or they found out the child that they had with this other person isn't theirs. If they found out the child that they had wasn't theirs, that it, they thought was theirs, it's the only reason that came out because this child either had sick or they had some form of like ailment and in order to treat that ailment, they needed to trace something back through DNA. Like, what what did this come from the mother's side? It's kind of like sickle cell. You know what I'm saying? Like, like that. But it might not even be sickle cell. It might be something else. But whatever, something came out. Shoot, you know how it's like if you need to get you need a kidney transplant and you gotta make sure you're the same blood type or you know, you know, and you gotta make sure you're a match. Somebody was trying to see if they were a match or they were trying to see what the issue was, whether it came from the mother's side or the father's side, whether it was paternal or maternal. And then, and boom, something came out. I know something, somebody's finances is about to be drained. Anyway, love y'all.
hit the, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, share. See y'all later.